Yeah, hello there and welcome back and let us continue with our lesson over here and in the previous lesson we learned some of the uh, clean architecture so let us try to follow it and create some of the features that we will be using over here so first of all let's go to our uh, leaf folder over here and let's create a new folder that will be of features and inside this we will be adding all of our feature that we are going to create First of all, we'll require a to do that is what we are going to create. And, and then we have the let's say uh, dashboard, D A S H B O A R, the dashboard that will be of our all of the dashboard that we are going to configure, like your home screen, your button navigation, and all of this stuff. And uh, here, let's create a uh, one more that will be of the uh, setting. So we don't have much of the feature uh, so let's just have a setting to do and the dashboard over here and let's go inside the to do folder and we will follow the clean architecture over here so let us separate it to a different layer over here so first of all i'll create a presentation layer and inside this presentation layer we will have a new folder that will be of the UI sorry it's not the that one it should be of the let's remove that and let's create a new folder and that will be of the UI and let's have the another one that will be of the state that we are going to have some of the state for the to do and then we will have the controller and uh, we have a controller state and the ui and in the ui we will have a one more folder sorry let's have a one more folder inside this ui and that will be of the widget over here and once we have that the presentation layer is ready and in the controller we will be creating all of our qubit and in the state we will be maintaining the uh, qubit state and then in the ui we will be having all of our screen and all of this stuff so in the ui let's create a new file over here and let's call this one as a uh, to do screen dot the dot file and let's create a state full widget for this one and let's call this one as a to do screen and uh, let's import the uh, material package over here and once we have that package from here let us return a scaffold and let's add the uh, app bar and the app bar will be of the simple app bar so let's go and add the uh, title for this one and the title will be of the const of the text and let's call this one as a to do or yeah so to do that should be fine and once we have that let's say our center title should be of the true so we just want to show that title and the center and then we have a body over here and in the body uh, let's just return a column for now and that should be fine and let's close it over here so we have the uh, our screen over here so the presentation layer is ready and let's go and create a new layer that will be of the uh, data and that data will hold all of our uh, like the api call or the local storage right so here we will create some more folder that will be of the uh, api and that we will be calling to the api here we will have um like the uh, repository r e p o s i t o r y repository and uh, let's create a new folder that will be of the uh, dto or the data transfer object so we'll have the uh, three folder over here inside the data layer api which will uh, configure for the api services and in the uh, data transfer object we'll be creating the um, like the request and the response object 
and in the repository we will hold the uh, create the uh, to do repository over here and uh, once we have that our uh, data layer and presentation layer is ready and uh, next let's create a new folder that will be of the uh, domain and in this domain we will be adding all of our mapper class or the models that we will be representing in our ui and the final layer will be of the uh, application and this application layer hole will we will create a service class that will be our business logic so it's it will be um, responsible for all of our business logic so later we will see how we can create our business logic for our to do app over here and for the simple app it's uh, absolutely not necessary to have all of this but since we are uh, using a clean architecture over here so we will be following the uh, all of this structure or the layer architecture over here to make it a clean and a maintainable application and uh, let's go to the uh, setting over here so i'll just copy uh, this presentation layer currently we don't have much of this stuff so instead of creating it i'll just paste it on the so to cancel it not move to trash but i want to uh, copy this and i want to uh, paste it on this setting all right let's paste it over here and also in the uh, i will paste it on the dashboard so for the dashboard and the uh, setting i don't think that we will be configuring the uh, api call or the we will have a business logic or the domain so let us keep it to the presentation over here and later if we need the rest of the layer then we will creating over here for now let's just keep it as a presentation on the dashboard as well as the setting but the to do is the application that we are going to build so this is the main feature so we will have all of the required four layer over here for now and let's go to the ui and let's uh just rename this one so this one should be of the let's rename this one and we will create this one as the uh, setting underscore screen over here and uh, let's go and change this one over here that should be of the uh, setting screen over there let's just copy this one and let's just paste it over here and here let's just set it to this setting over here as it did ti in the setting right and let's remove this one and once that is done we are going to go on the setting and let's go to the uh the dashboard dashboard is the where we will be creating our bottom navigation and all of those stuff so for now let's just uh, rename this one to be a uh, dashboard screen right let's go over here and let's say uh dashboard screen over here and uh, let's rename this one over here too so that should be of a dash uh, b o a r the dashboard and let's copy it and let's replace it over here and here we'll just say this each of the uh, home or i guess we will not require a uh, ambar over here since we will be having um, this is the main place to hold our all of the other pages like the uh, settings screen and our to the screen and we'll have a button navigation over here so currently we don't have it so let's add that one so i guess i can remove this one from here so app bar let's remove this one for now and here we need to add the um, button navigation bar and that's uh let's just give uh, for now we just place it a row over here and uh, we have created our uh, required feature that we will be using on dashboard setting and the to do so i guess you understand the concept over here why we are creating a uh, different layer so especially on the to do this is our main feature and we have our application which holds all of our business logic data will be responsible for connecting to the api or to the local storage and we have a domain that will hold the models and our mapper class right that we are representing the domain will be responsible for 
uh, all of the mapping like let's say you are getting a response object from the api and uh, you want to clean that data and so cleanest data back to the ui so you want to represent a different kind of the um the data back to the ui so that is the responsibility of the uh, domain over there and in the re uh, presentation we have a controller that uh, we will be having later let's create a qubit will be on in, in the controller and we will have some state right we will represent some state for our to do and then we have the uh, ui that will hold the screen and some of the widgets that we will be creating on later so i guess that's all for this lesson hope you got some concept over here and let's meet up in the uh, next lecture till then have a great day